Hi everyone, welcome to another video. I'm going to talk to you today about using values in art and the basics of values. Value is something that you can use to create a lot of space in your drawing, you can describe form with values in your drawing, and you can describe lighting by using value. This video is just a way to describe the basics of values to you to help you along in your journey as an artist. So first of all, what is value? Simply, it's how much white or black a color or hue is. It's usually depicted as a gradient or measured in a scale, showing light values, midtone values, and dark values. What is a value scale? A value scale is something that you can use to determine your darkest dark and your lightest light and all of the midtones in between. So to make one of your own, determine your darkest dark and add it to one end of your scale. Determine the lightest light and add it to the other side of the scale. Between those two poles, Find the value that is in between, and this will be your middle tone. If you want a high contrast value scheme, make sure that there are many steps between your lightest light and your darkest dark. What is the role of value in a drawing or painting? First of all, value can depict light. The use of value depicts light in art. By using your darker values, you can create a blend of darks that describe the form shadow, which depicts how light falls across a form and how light describes form, or a cast shadow, which depicts how forms block light from reaching other forms in the scene. Another way that value can depict light in a drawing or painting is by showing ambient occlusion. So the spaces where light can't reach or escape, and this is usually where two forms meet. Another role of value in a drawing or painting is to depict space. The best example of this is atmospheric perspective. By using value, we can describe closer forms and further away forms to create more space. Closer forms have a higher contrast than further back towards the horizon. So the forms that are closest to us in the drawing or painting will be darker or lighter depending on the surface hue and the lighting scheme. How do you determine what values to use and where? Where is the light the brightest and the shadows the darkest? Those are your value poles or landmarks. Squint to generalize chunks of value within your piece. Is it reading as an interesting description of value in the work that you're making? Does your eye move around the piece the way that you want it to? Zoom out to see the big picture values. Or if you're working traditionally, take a step back. Is there enough value contrast to clearly see the image from far away? Thank you so much for watching my video today. I really hope that you learned something about values and art from this video. If you did like it, please remember to click the like button, and if you want to see more videos like this in the future, make sure you're subscribed and hit the bell if you want notifications. Again, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!